Hey, what's up guys? Martin here. And in today's video, I wanted to show you the newly updated 3D model map of the Fagadalsfjall Iceland's volcano eruption. Today is September 20th. This map has been developed and published on September 17th. So very, very close showing the landscape. Um, right now, the volcano is not active. It has been asleep for about 48 hours. There hasn't been any activity going on, any eruptions, any lava visuals at the crater site. The lava stream has kind of turned off a bit and slowed down. So there's really no actual activity happening at the moment. I just wanted to take this moment and show you this newly uh, 3D model map, which I love. I think it's probably the best photographic 3d model map out there um, so if you're seeing it for the first time model has been uh, created by the Icelandic institute of natural history it's also in collaboration with the civil protection and emergency management of iceland the national land survey of iceland and the university of iceland so it's aerial photography that has been taken it's like a bunch of images and they put it together into this 3d model map so let me kind of just move around here and show you what has changed since last time. Everything has changed. Last month, all the lava has been flowing up north, up here, and has been uh, filling up Medali Valley. And it's just, the lava has just kept flowing and flowing into there, filling it up. But now it has returned and reversed back into Nathai Valley, which is down here. Um, and in this model, it's great. You could see the lava flow that we all saw in the recent days, which is coming down right over here. And yes, so now there is a, an opening coming from the volcano that has been pushing all this new lava into Nathai Valley and filling it up once again. So the concern directed back to Nathai Valley because it's heading south and um, south is where the main road is, the new parking area, which is right next to path C, which goes up this mountain here. And you get to see the volcano from a nice distance. That's still open. Um, path A, which is right over here. You can't see the full path, but it connects right over here. Has been closed off as of September 20th. Or 19th, I think they closed it off because the lava flow coming down the mountain has disrupted the, um, the trail here. So as of right now, it is closed as of safe, for safety concerns. So people are being directed to Path B, which you can't see here, but it's around this area here. And Path B is the longest, more difficult kind of path. And you end up somewhere along this area here. And, and the best part is that you get to be really close to the volcano. Uh, it's around this area right over here. So check this out. Check the map out. I'll put the link in the description. Brand new map as of September 17th. And if you see any interesting things here... Make sure to leave them in the comments below. I'm always interested to see if you find things in these maps, which there is always something. So I will see you in the next video. Stay safe. I will continue monitoring the uh, volcano activity and see what's happening in the coming hours and days. Take care. Bye-bye.